Well, we have lots to get to in first alert safety deaths this morning. Millions of airbag inflators could be recalled early next year after two deaths were reported, triggering a near decade long investigation. Kristen is at the first alert safety desk today. Kristen, if the recall happens, what does this mean for the future of airbags? Well, it could trigger a long and complicated repair of these defective airbags in millions of vehicles. A meeting was held last Thursday in Washington, D.C., where the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration discussed its decision that two airbag inflator manufacturers, Arc Automotive and Delphi Automotive Systems, should recall inflators that explode with excess pressure and shoot shrapnel into the driver and front passenger. An investigation has been ongoing since July of 2015 after reports of ruptures on two vehicles. According to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration's initial decision in December, there have been seven inflator ruptures in the U.S. since 2014. One driver was killed after a crash in a 2015 Chevrolet Traverse when metal shards flew out. All other drivers and one passenger were primarily injured in the face. Four of the incidents involved a traverse with the latest happening in March of this year. According to ARC, the seven ruptures that happened in the U.S. were isolated incidents. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration is expected to make a decision in December. Coming up in our next half hour, I'll tell you about children's sleepers that are being recalled due to a potential burn risk. Aisha? All right.